Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Ezekiel Obaba Tunde and this is Tech Tuesday. Tech Tuesday is basically where we review tech gadgets and in today's video, we are going to be reviewing the cameras used in Monzion movies. I'm very sure everyone is excited to know because all of these movies blessed us. So we are going to be doing it this way. It's going to be in an hierarchical order, right? So we're going to start from the least expensive to the most expensive and obviously we know the price comes more quality most times and so the very first camera comes with a fun fact did you know that there is a particular monzion movie that was actually shot on a mobile phone yeah most of us probably do not know we think all the movies are shot with cameras with professional cameras dslr and what have you but there is a particular monzion movie that was shot with an iphone 7 yes and i have an iphone 7 here not the exact iphone 7 i'm sure many of us will be thinking oh what does the quality look like at the moment i'm doing a test so you can actually see what it looks like it's actually very very nice it's very nice and the name of the movie is family riot next up canon 60d canon 60d basically shoots at 1080p however i don't have it with me here in the studio but we do have a senior brother in the studio and that's the canon 60d this also shoots many monzion movies which i'll get to in a minute the 60d is somewhat like the 60 but it's not exactly like this this has more functions much better picture quality dynamic range so i'll be listing the movies that were shot with the canon 60d not this one the junior brother and we have Johnny in Seku Ignition. Very great movie. We also have a hundred thousand. This one, it's about I think 15 minutes. Very great storyline. The picture quality also nice. That's the 60D. Next up, we have House on Fire. Now, House on Fire, some parts were shot with the 60, but it began with the 60D. And now the 60D was actually gotten in 2011, 2012, thereabout. And it was used up until 2015 when the Canon 60, this camera right here, was gotten. Now there are so many movies that were actually shot in the space of these three years. We have the Bosom Fire. Then we also have the Professional Actor, which featured <laughs> the greatest of all time, Joshua Magbam, J. Mikey. And also we have the Accountant. Then we have the Manager. This next movie comes with a fun fact. And I'm very sure quite a number of us do not know that there's actually a Monzayo movie that was shot in India. And that's the Rupanta. Rupan Rupanta. Rupanta. Not Black Panther. Rupanta. And we also have Harmony Deal. And lastly, not lastly, actually, there are so many. Sunset at Midday. Now we'll be moving on to the Canon 6D. That's the senior brother of the 6D. And this camera is a beast. Because it did a whole lot of work. It's basically the Monzion transition camera from 1080p to 4K. It shoots at 1080p. Let's go to the movies that were shot with this Canon 60. We have The Spell. We have Haunted. Film written by Sister Darasimi Bomba Oyo. Like I said earlier, House of Fire was shot with both 60 and 60D. So it started with 60D and transitioned to the 60. The earlier parts of House on Fire were shot on the 60D. Later went to the 60. Also, we have Life of the Billows. Everything will be linked down below so check the description if you don't watch any of these videos so you can watch them and you will be blessed the next video is the breaking point and also we have the greatest movie of all time so Abedre season one was shot with this camera right here Abedre season two was also shot with this camera right here then we have land of fury Personally, that's like my best Monzion movie. I love that movie so much. So many visual effects, so many. It was just, ah, uh, if you've not watched it, to be linked down below. And also, we have Bemi. Bemi was written by Sister Ella Agbamiloye. And also, we have, actually, now I, I really don't know which I prefer more, Abatua or Land of Fury. Abatua just has, ah, uh, I love Abatua so much. But we're not here to talk about movies. Anyway, Abatua season one was also shot on this camera. So that's basically all I have on my list for movies that were shot with the Canon 6D. We are done with this and we'll be moving to the big tiers. So now I have the Black Magic. This Black Magic shoots at 4K and this is the very first Black Magic Monzion has. Now, movies that were shot with this, The Train is actually the very first movie that was shot with this. This was gotten in 2020 and The Train also was shot in 2020. It was shot at 4K, but it was later downscaled to 1080p. So, if you are checking it on YouTube, you are not watching 4K, you are watching 1080p. Many movies were actually shot with this. Next up, Abattoir. Abattoir Season 2 was shot with this Black Magic. Next movie is Shackles. Shackles was also 
also shots with the black magic and also we have burning coals abedre now abedre three four and five were shot with this five was a little bit of an hybrid because it was shot with this and the next camera i'm going to be talking about then my dream also written by mommy gloria Bamloye, was shot on this camera and the last on my list which is most certainly not the least wow that was great <laughs> is enoch so enoch was shot with this and it was also shot with the 6k which i'll be reviewing next can we just do like a and here we are we have the 6k black magic this is actually relatively new i mean it was gotten new no doubt so this camera was gotten last year 2022 as you all know it has shot a lot of movies like i listed in a previous category it shot a bj5 it was the cam a while the cam b was the black magic 4k so they used it for a bj season 5 other movies they used it for abattoir season 3 and enoch too enoch was shot with this next up we have the black magic 6k pro it's right here wow camera is so big and it's got this battery pack here which actually makes it shoot for long because cameras like this they have so many functionalities they obviously take power so we need to have sort of like a power bank and that's why it's this big at the moment of recording this video you guys have actually not seen any mozaya movie that was shot with this camera alongside the 6k but it's coming out soon about to season four maybe by the time you're watching this video it's out already so i have to make a confession now i said we're going from the least to the biggest and actually this is the biggest camera now but now because i was recording on the next camera i meant to review i'm going to make that exception so you don't start thinking this camera is bigger than this camera or more expensive than this camera no the camera i'll be reviewing next she actually did a great job in many monzion movies and i'll be telling us how the camera was used now i'm going to be reviewing the camera that shot some things many people didn't actually know that he did and that's the oh wow it's here already. This is the Canon M6 Mark II. This camera is for True Talk and it was gotten last year, 2022. So basically, all of True Talk's videos were shot with this from 2022, obviously. This actually shot some parts in Enoch. The bureau where Broboye was throwing the volleyball and doing all of these things, it was placed on a gimbal because it's light. Now, the Black Magic should have been the one that was placed on a gimbal, but because it's very heavy, it's going to be placed on the gimbal. So this is actually lightweight. It was placed instead. So the bureaus were taken with this another movie that was shot with it is the short film by sister ella mike bamelui framed go and watch it this camera is actually a very good camera for what it does i think it's quite cheap it's lightweight it's very portable and it's just a very beautiful camera and um we finally come to the end of today's tech tuesday if you enjoyed the video please give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to the channel and don't forget to hit that notification bell because if you subscribe without hitting the notification bell you will not be notified when we drop a video and i'm very sure you enjoy watching our videos so please make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit the bell share with your friends preach the gospel like the scripture says till next time maintain the zion culture bye